so the next video we are having that is basically the conduction of heart what does it mean it mean that the electrical signal that is generated by the heart how like it's working okay so today we will discuss about the con mechanism of contraction of conduction of heart which means that through which the nerve impulse will generate let's see how the nerve impulse will generate okay so for example this is the heart and we are having the four chambers okay for example this is the right atrium left atrium right ventricle and left ventricle okay <clears throat> so the conducting system of the heart is basically consist of four components number 1 is the sa node sa node second we are having that is basically the av node which is called av node and here we are having the fibers like structure we are calling that as a bundle of his or you can say that as a atrioventricular bundle atrioventricular bundle okay and next we are having that is basically the the nerve fibers which is like this what is this that is basically the purkinje fibers purkinje fibers okay how it works so the nerve impulse what is nerve impulse first of all the nerve impulse is basically the electric current electric current that is basically generate how they are generated by the ions like sodium potassium ions across the cross across the membrane so these ions will basically spread by the muscles of the heart okay these ions will spread like you can say spread by the muscles of heart so the cardiac muscles that we are having so the, through that they will be spread out and from the muscles the heart will work so the cardiac muscles are also called myogenic what is myogenic myogenic which means that these are basically that type of muscle or the heart is basically the myogenic why we are calling myogenic because the heart can generate the their own impulse their own impulse basically okay if we talk about the sa node what is sa node sa node is basically the basically it is present in the right atrium but the upper side of the wall okay and it is called the sino atrical node okay the full form of this is sino atrical node if we talk about the av which is basically called the at trio ventricular node ventricular node okay so sino basically this is basically the this is the short is called the sa node and this is the av node okay sa node is basically work as a pacemaker what is pacemaker pacemaker basically a this is a pacemaker which can generate the own impulse okay and sa node is basically the muscles like tissues which are myofibers what are myofibers these are basically thread like structure but that generally like that is a thread like structure that basically that is a nerve like structure or fibers like structure through which the impulse will got pass impulse will pass to the av node okay so if you talk about the sa node that is basically less conductive why this is less conductive because they are having less charges less charges 
so this nerve impulse is basically controlled by the autonomic nervous system so what does it mean it means that the autonomic nervous system basically give command to this sa node from the ending of the nerve like we are having the ending of the nerve through which the command will come by the autonomic nervous through the you can say that ending of the nerve which will open into the sa node okay so you can see that this pacemaker is basically less conductivity because of the little less, less charges little or less charges okay so the sa node the here are the basically you can see that through the av node the basically the fibers are coming that is basically called the bundle of his and this bundle of his is basically you can say that further divided into the right and the left fiber that are basically called the Purkinje fibers for example so when the you can say that the right atrium and the left atrium will get contract this will basically uh, you can say that the contract and the blood from them will move toward the this one right ventricle and the left ventricle so the signal will generate by the sa node the nerve impulse will generate by the sa node to the av node and then av node to the this bundle and the bundle to the this one the purkinje fibers okay so again i am telling you that this is basically the sa node okay so this is basically close to the vena cava as you guys all know the vena cava is basically open the superior and the inferior so this is basically uh, you can say that the specialized group of the cardiac muscle fiber okay which is basically called the av node as you guys all know this one so which is basically if you talk about the bundle of his that are basically the bundle which is passing from the a through the other downward of the av node and this is basically extend or you can say that they are basically present at the interventricular septum what is interventricular septum interventricular septum which means that this is basically dividing the right and the left ventricle okay dividing the last left and the uh, right ventricle this is present between the inter ventricular septum septum which means that the, this a part which is divided into the right and the left so the there the inter inter you can say that the interventricular septum is present which is basically dividing the right and the left atrium okay so the signal will move to the right atrium to the av node which time consumed that is basically 0.04 second okay so through the through the you can say that this uh, you can say that this one uh through the you can say that sa node to the you can say that the av node the signal is passed that is zero, the time that is consumed that is basically the ra uh, to the um, you can say sa node to the av node that that is basically consuming the time that is 0.04 second okay so this is basically a rhythm or a nerve impulse is basically generated in the heart okay so through the av node the this will now impulse will pass to the interauricular septum as you guys all know i told you guys after coming down there are two fiber as you guys all know i told you guys that is bundle of his which is right in the left further the branches is branches are there which is called the purkinje fibers so from the av av node to the purkinje fibers the time that is that is reached the speed that is basically required that is 1.5 meter um, 1 per 5 minus a uh, 4 meter per second that is basically the speed okay first of all the blood will come into these both uh, atrium then it will contract the nerve impulse will generate to the av node and then the, this will like you can say that the blood will come into the ventricles okay ventricles so bundle will bundle of his will give impulse to the purkinje fibers so when the purkinje fibers basically like give all the you can say that uh, you can say that uh, the nerve into the hole the heart so this uh, from the right uh, ventricle the the blood will move into the aorta and this one left ventricle this will through which the this will move into the Uh, no, from from the left ventricle the this will move to the aorta and this will move to the coronary artery and pulmonary artery and the uh, systemic artery so through which this is the basically the impulse basically is generating into the heart so this was about the uh, 
the conduction of the heart this is basically the mechanism which is composed of the four components okay so this is basically present in the ventricular uh, walls the purkinje fiber so this will like uh, give the uh, all the you can say the impulse into the uh, heart so this was about the conduction of heart yeah one more thing i want to tell you guys is that that if you talk about the av so av is basically a pace settler this is basically a pace settler what does it mean pace settler means that it is basically here the conductivity is more as you guys all know at pacemaker i said that this is a pacemaker here the conductivity is less so this is a pace settler where the conductivity is the more conductivity is more where the there is a increasing of the conductivity so yeah this was about the conduction of the heart in the next video we will discuss about the ecg